Got a little pump job going today. It's Friday. Huh? Are you recording? Yeah. Huh. I think they know they're going to be on YouTube. Do they? I think so. <laughs> yeah, he's going. He was saying something. I could tell he was like. <laughs> like right. Let's see what we got going. We just pouring footers? Just footers? See? Just this? This is all? Oh, and back here? <clears throat> Easy. Alright, let's get set up. I'm just gonna run some two inches today. Pump some pea gravel through it. Easy. Pull this pump up and start getting some hoses out. Go ahead and throw some rubber boots on. It's pretty muddy over there. This company is a uh, structure company called American Structure. They usually do like a lot of foundation work for houses that are settling. So I was not expecting just a plain out footer. That's a pretty easy pump job. We usually go up under houses for them and pump footers and walls, stuff like that. So sometimes it's pretty chaotic, but pretty straightforward today. Which is nice it's friday we've been working i think wednesday was like an 18 hour day yesterday was like a 13 hour day so i think this is the only job we're doing today easy peasy content won't be that interesting but hey part of it some days are crazy some days are easy get any footage for thursday i was so wore out after getting home I think I went to bed around 1 a.m. Wednesday night, or I guess Thursday morning, honestly. I had to get back up, go pump like 1,200 blocks. And I really just didn't want to go home and edit. I figured I'd get home around four or so, but we ended up not even getting home till eight o'clock at night again. So I'm kind of glad I didn't video because I would not have been up to editing that. And if I would have had the footage, I would have had to have edited it and I'd have been up even later. So I figured I'd get a little footage for Friday. Man, it's a muddy mess. Rolling up these hoses is not gonna be fun. It's gonna be covered in gunk. Try to keep them out of that ditch. Woo, what a mess. I think these guys still got some rebar to tie. But yeah, like I said, no footage for Thursday, even though they were some pretty interesting jobs. We had the uh, block on the house to do, and then we had some footers we did last night, about 20 yards and footers. But yeah, at least I was able to get some footage today. All right, all of our hoses are laid out. We got 50, 100, 125 on. And we got water. That's always a plus. That makes the day way better when you got water on the job site. Can't beat that. I don't know where the finishers went. They left. Guess we really don't need them. It's just a footer. Looks like they got one, two, maybe three step downs in it. Waiting on some mud now. They should be here in about 40 minutes. We're ready. We are still waiting on concrete. I'm two hours late right now. Concrete should be pulling up soon. Get some slick fat mixed up.
one. Shut off your pack. All right, we plugged. You put it back forward. Yeah. Breaking it loose, I ain't gonna keep packing it. Reverse me. Reverse and take the pressure off of me. A little bit out. Hold on. Go for it. Drop it. Oh. Got some slippery boots with this red clay underneath. Muck.
just trying to perk. It broke free. Got it? All right, that pack just shot out. There you go, you hand me that ball. The ball? See? Gracias. You get mud? Yeah, we're good. I would just work with what your PSI show and I ain't at the pump looking at pressure. About 800. Well, we got it out. We're pumping now. It's just one truck, so we should be good on plugs now. Unless a rock or cat head falls in the hopper. Something crazy. Go there and help him get it back to that back side of that footer. Drag it back. Good. That water's flowing, he's pushing it all back out of that footer. We've been getting a lot of rain lately. More? Let me run the hose. Let me run it. I'll take the hose. Okay. Yeah. I got it. There's something in that concrete. Yeah. You see it? That yeah. black stuff? Yeah. Think it's the chemicals or what? I don't think there's chemicals in it. Accelerator ain't black. Yeah. Can you call the guys over here to help with hoses? Yeah. Let me put Came to the conclusion that that black stuff, that's fly ash. Gotta be. The driver said they got a new batch in it. It's pretty dark, so I think they just put a lot of fly ash in it. Probably trying to save on their Portland supplementing fly ash. But that's a lot of it. Near the end here. Well, I got dirty today. These hoses are covered. Huh? I'll have to get it. Hold this for a second. I'll have to grab it. I know the vicinity that I put it in. Okay. Not the exact spot. Oh. Grab this ball and our sledge.
Had a few raindrops hit us, but I don't think it's gonna do much. It's in that white bucket. Let me go. <laughs> All right, we got about three feet to go. We'll finish it out with what we got left in the hopper. Go on a full hopper in these subdivisions. Then I'll blow the rest out of my hoses. Thank you. All right. Make sure that one's shut. That one's on. Pressure was up to had a PSI on it. <laughs> Gotta be easy not to put too much pressure on this, or you'll have a blowout. It'll hurt the guy holding the holding the hose. I also don't want to splatter all them vehicles. Turn it off for just a second. Let some of that pressure dissipate in them hoses. Get your ice cream. <laughs> he pulled up in the company van playing the ice cream truck song. Get some of these hoses washed off. Get this red clay off of them. Messy job, boy. Clean. 
Yeah. Well, them hoses got dirty. Yeah. <coughs> huh? <laughs> Put all this up That's it. Love these hoses. We're gonna get out of here. We uh, got some fun jobs coming up next week. A few pours, a few pump jobs, forming. A little bit of everything. So we will see y'all next week. Adios.